So this is the new Topcon MC Mobile system, recently released, or pre-release for Sharpgrade G128. We're just doing a little bit of validation testing. So this is the rotation sensor, blade sensor, which measures the, the blade roll, or sorry, the blade slope. Uh, new style junction box up here. So this is where you can plug your laser receivers, sonic trackers, and GPS into, which feeds back to the new bulky connector for quick disconnect. Around the back of the machine, we have located the Topcon radio, which is up in that back corner. So that's for your UHF style corrections, and it draws 3G or 4G mobile corrections for network if you're using GPS off uh, RTK network. We have a hitch sensor down here, so this measures the the pitch in, or sorry, the pitch of the machine implement. And within the cab itself, there's another body sensor which measures measures body heading, pitch, and roll which is very important because being a single elevation sensor, when you're going backwards, the machine actually recognizes that it's going backwards. Um, and also in there is a new comms gateway module, the MCX1, which now holds all your calibration data. So the, the tablet, the wireless tablet inside the cab is not actually tethered to anything. It uses Wi-Fi or a hotspot connection and draws all the calibration data from that new little module inside the belly of the machine. So just a quick run through on the inside of this machine and how it all operates. So the, the joysticks have additional controls down here for your wings and rotate and automatic is engaged by double pressing the lift on the left raise ramp engaging in and out of auto and then again it's repeated on the other side for rotating around the other way and the other adjustable wing on the outside um, the tablet again all wireless so you can position the tablet that's just an old uh, GX55 cable we we're previously running the the other generation screen but isn't actually required in this one so you can position it there you can position up high uh, it doesn't really matter and, and you can go landscape and portrait mode and we can see all the design in here um, all movable uh, you can see the 3d view there if that's something that um, you guys want to see and you can change your point of elevation reference very quickly quick scroll through and the beauty is is this is all the same as your excavator and very, very, very similar to Pocket 3D. So again, the guys that are using this technology within the machine have the ability to pick up a rover pole and verify and check their work very straightforward and easily without too much of a learning curve in between the two.